Kemp's family, if you know, had several such plantation houses. But that old cotton-picking wealth has transformed into a company Kemp calls Plantation Partners LLC, part of a portfolio of private forests. He'll cut down these trees for Coke Industries to turn it all into toilet paper. The governor values this little toilet paper farm at $2.2 million. He's got a lot of others. Kemp's family was once one of the largest plantation owners in Georgia. And here is one of their grand manor houses. Even the toys taught the children the difference between their happy lives and the lives of those they owned. But to find the original source of their wealth, you have to travel to the humid Savannah coast. Georgia's plantation system was created by the first governor of Georgia and Kemp's family, James Habersham. Habersham became one of the wealthiest men in the South by transforming agriculture. That is, he was first to import captured Africans into Georgia. Sales boomed, even when some of his products committed suicide or died of smallpox on the slaver's ships. 